channel. I'm excited. I'm about to get to this review on this product that gave me the best twist out ever. I'm excited. Like, this product is dope. Like, where has it been? Why isn't everyone not talking about it? I don't know. Y'all tripping. But this too, by the way. I love this. I'll put the link to where I got it. I'm not really sure off the top of my head where I got it, but it's pretty dope. Um, it doesn't dry my hair out, so when I get out of the shower or I have a fresh wash, it's pretty easy to put on. It's just, and then you just twist it up, twist it up, and then there's a little tab right here, and voila. How you doing? So, get yourself one of these amazing, amazing best thing so far. All right, so we're gonna get into this twist out. Let's figure out what product I use. All right, y'all. Let's jump into this twist out. I'm so excited because this is gonna be my first official twist out. I'm excited. I hope it doesn't go horribly wrong because I've seen a lot of fails. But um, I'm just gonna be putting my hair into different sections so that I can manage it a little better because my hair is thick at the roots, if you don't know. So my hair, I think I want to say is maybe a 3C, 4B, 4A hair. I don't know. Leave a comment below. Help me out, please. So I know you guys are wondering what the heck product I am using, but I am using one of my favorites so far since I have been natural. This is my favorite product. Look at that shine, y'all. Look at that moisture. Oh my God. Okay, so I'm gonna be using the main choice. Ancient Egyptian Anti-Breakage Repair. This stuff smells so good. So good. Oh my gosh. And the slip on it, the grip on it, the bottle, everything about this product is amazing. It does wonders for my hair. It makes it so soft and manageable. I love it and I don't have to really add anything to it. I do add um, a little bit of any type of oil that I'm using that day. Today I use Jamaican black castor oil, 100% organic. I got this from one of my natural whole food stores I wanna say, so pretty great. Um, other than that, let's just get into this twist out. Go ahead and get this stuff twisted up for you guys. I'm excited. So let's just twist this up. Like I said, I'm just spraying a little bit of water on there just to wet it, get it a little bit. Um, so because it's a little dry right now, let it air dry a little bit. But um, just spray a little bit of water and then I add a little product using my fingertips to detangle my hair. Um, very seldom do I try to detangle with a big brush or with big sections. I usually try to use my fingers for the most part and then maybe go in with my denim brush and brush it out just a little bit. But did you guys see that? That was so shiny. The slip is amazing, amazing. But be gentle, be patient, be patient. I can't say it enough, be patient. We should make a song about naturals and being patient because it is the number one rule. Be patient. So um, I'm just gonna go ahead and finish these twists out. Go ahead and detangle the end, spray the product, use, I mean, spray the pro water, use the product. Other than that, I'm just going to repeat this all the way around, guys. So I will be back. So I know I said I was going to finish my hair and then I was going to come back, but do you see this? The main choice did they thing with this. I really love it. Did you see how that looked? Okay, 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 okay. Let me finish, let me finish. I'm gonna go ahead and finish my twist out, but I just had to come show you guys the way that this product looked. It is amazing. I was just sitting there looking at it like, it is so pretty. Like, it needs to be like a fingernail polish, like ancient Egyptian fingernail polish on fleek. What? Oh, but I'm just saying. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and finish my hair, y'all. I'm gonna let y'all watch this in peace. <laughs>
this is where I'm at so far. Half of my head is finally finished. I know y'all see me have to take that little break of a stretch because my arms was hurting. But make sure you guys are liking and subscribing. I'm going to go ahead and finish this out. I love it. 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 But um, I'm going to leave this in. Usually I think you would do this overnight. I'm not going to do it overnight. I'm just going to actually wear it like this all day. Got some running around to do. And then I'm just going to come back and take them out. See how it comes out. I'm loving it. They're so cute. Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> I'm excited. I want to take them out now. Like I can't wait for them to dry so I can for you guys to uh, be back on the channel make sure you guys are subscribing and liking and pushing that alert button so you guys can be the first ones to see any video i post i am hair by vase and we mm -hmm. are out. So as you can see, my hair is already done with the twist. So just going to show you guys a quick little tip for those who may need to have their hair drying but still have other shit to do because sometimes that is me. So just going to take some bobby pins, be really careful with your ends, and you're just going to pin them up and pin them up and voila, put a scarf on and bam, baby, that's about it. Then I just touch up them edges just a little bit get them baby hairs you yeah, know but that's about it y'all i just touch a little baby hairs up throw a little eyelashes on by the way i'm gonna have to do me a little something something on my eyelashes because a lot of people always ask um and no i don't wear any makeup very seldom do i wear makeup just eyelashes and eyeliner make sure y'all hit in that like and subscribe button while y'all asking me all these questions love y'all Mwah. Thank you.